Eduardo Ortiz de Landazuri was a physician who lived in Granada, Spain, where he was known as a great doctor and enjoyed a good status as a professor of the Department of Medicine. However, Eduardo and his wife Laura Busca decided to leave their life in Granada behind to dedicate themselves to an emerging and risky project, building the clinic and the Department of Medicine for the University of Nevada. It was an initiative promoted by the founder of Opus Dei, St. Jose Maria Escriva. The university wanted to better the academic and human formation of young people, and Eduardo's experience made him invaluable at the university. He used to say the patient is always right, not for marketing purposes, but to say that you have to listen carefully to what the patient says, because with the patient's complaints, symptoms and experiences, you can make an accurate diagnosis. On the other hand, if you go in like it's a routine and you see the disease but not the patient, you miss many things. While Eduardo worked directly with patients in the hospital, his wife Laura performed another important role. She dedicated herself to the care of her children. Some were born in Madrid, others in Granada, and still others in Pamplona. She also supported her husband in his enormous work, which of course she helped him make compatible with family life. So I would say they were like two cards in a house of cards leaning against each other. And one without the other cannot stand, right? The couple were married until Eduardo passed away in 1985 at the age of 75. Throughout their 44 years of marriage, the two proved that it was possible to live a life of service dedicated to work as well as one's family. Doctors, researchers, and historians help us decipher the most remembered crime in history. For the first time, we look at the mystery of the cross from a scientific perspective. The Passion of Jesus, a medical investigation.